also look at the self-evident economic statistics demonstrating that since Paul Ehrlich and his um, population bomb and the Club of Rome, etc., these anti-population zealots started beating the drum back in 1965, saying that we were all going to starve to death by the year 2000 when we'll have four billion people, God help us, and now we have eight, and the relationship between wealth growth and population has been extremely positive, not negative or flat, and everyone on the planet virtually is richer than well, that anyone had ever conceived of. And it's clearly the case that we could manage this if we had half the will to do it.